Hello, Internet! I'm Hamster Bomb, and you are watching some more Undertale. So, unfortunately, we lost, like, all of our stuff against Undyne. Um, uh, but we got past Undyne. Sorry, Undyne, like, told us there was totally human in the area. So, like, us real guards are blocking off the elevators for now. Nah. Even if the elevators aren't working anyway, we'll do our best, Miss Undyne. Yeah. And that guy just doesn't say anything. Okay, well, I'm just gonna explore then. Well, you guys just do your thing. Oh, it's a ferry that takes me back to the other air. I got it. Okay, that's what the fast traveling thing's for. I'm getting... Excuse me? Oh! Well, look, I'm on the television. Hello, mommy. Okay, this is weird. I'm gonna run up this. <laughs> okay, I guess not. Can I turn this off? It's you? It's you? It's too dark to see near the walls. Okay, so... I gotta shut something off here. I can't quite... Uh, dog food. What is happening in here? Hi! Why am I on camera? Oh! Hey, it's uh, Maggie Simpson. Oh, my god! I didn't expect you to show up so soon! I haven't showered. I'm barely dressed. It's all messy, and... Uh, hi? Wasn't expecting you to live here. Um, hiya? I'm Dr. Alphys. I'm Asgore's royal scientist. But, but uh, I'm not one of the bad guys. Actually, since you stepped out of the ruins, I've, um, been observing your journey through my console. Your fights, your friendships, everything. Oh, that'd have been interesting if you were killing everyone. I was originally going to stop you, but watching someone on a screen really makes you root for them. So, uh, now I want to help you. Using my knowledge, I can easily guide you through the hot land. I know a way right to Asgore's castle, no problem. Well, actually, um, there's just a tiny issue. A long time ago, I made a robot named, um, Metaton. Originally, I built him to be an ex, ex an entertainment robot. Uh, you know, like a robotic TV star or something. Anyway, recently I decided to make him more useful. You know, just some small practical adjustments. Like, um, anti-human anti combat features. Oh, of course when I saw you coming, I immediately decided I have to remove those features. Unfortunately, I may have made a teensy mistake while doing so, and, um... Now he's an unstoppable killing machine with a thirst for human blood. <laughs> uh, but, um, hopefully he won't run into him. That's great. I'm sure we won't. Huh? I'm... Uh, so, uh, did you hear something? No. Oh, fun! Fun! This is gr Oh, no. Oh, fun. Oh, yes. Welcome, beauties. Oh. To today's quiz show. Oh, boy. I can already tell it's going to be a great show. Everyone give a big hand for our wonderful contestant. Yeah, this is much better than what I was thinking. Never played before, go ahead. Just no problem. It's simple. There's only one rule. Answer correctly. Or you die! Oh. Oh. This show's a lot less fun now. Metaton attacks. Oh, uh, oh, uh, uh, act. Uh, Metaton. Check or cry. Um. Cries. Check. Metaton attack. 30, defense 255, his metal body renders him invulnerable to attack. Let's start with an easy one. What's the prize for answering correctly? Money, mercy, more questions, new car. Um. Mercy, ah, you wish wrong, ah! Squish show continues. And it's on. Cry! Screaming is against the rules. Here's your terrific prize. What's the king's full name? Um... No, Lord Fl Fuzzy Pushover Dr. Friendship, Asgore Dreamer. Yeah, what a terrific answer! 
How was I supposed to? What was the? Quiz show continues. Well, apparently I'm gonna die, Metaton. Spare, I guess. Enough about you. Let's talk about me. What are robots made of? Oh, oh. Um, hopes and dreams, metal and magic, sugar and spice, sips and snails. Hopes and dreams. Ah, oh, I don't know. Squish show continues. Spare. Here's another easy one for you. Two trains, train A should be simultaneously departure station A and station B. Station. Ah! I don't know. C. Ow! But it's okay. It's fair. Don't count on your victory. How many flies are in this jar? What? I don't. Oh, it's so darn close too. B. Ow! Completely, utterly wrong. Uh, spare! Time to break out the big guns. In the dating simulation video game, Mute Miss Kid. Oh, oh! I know this one! It's snail ice cream. In the fourth chapter, everyone goes to the beach and she buys ice cream for all of her friends, but it's a snail flavor and she's the only one who wants it. It's my favorite part of the game because it's actually a very powerful message about friendship. And. Alphas, Alphas, Alphas. You aren't helping our contestant, are you? Oh, you should have told me. I'll ask a question. You'll be sure to know the answer to. What does Dr. Alphys- Who does Dr. Alphys have a question- uh, a crush on? Uh... Uh... Oh! The human! Seriously? My, my. How conceited can you get? I love it! And while you are completely wrong, you deserve some credit. Can this stop? I have one HP and nothing to heal myself with. I've seen her watch you on her computer screen, smiling when you succeed, shrieking when you fail, and always, always whispering. No, wrong. You have to go that way. Yeah, I know, right? I bet everyone in the comments is doing that to me right now. In its own way, is this not love? Well, well, well. With Dr. Office helping you, the show has no dramatic tension. We can't go on like this. No, we can't, but, but. This was just the pilot episode. Next up, more drama, more romance, more bloodshed. Until next time. Thank you, Doc. Oh. I lived. I have one HP, dude. So, please heal me. Are you a dude? Well, that was certainly something. Heal me! Wait, wait. Let me give you my phone number. Th then, maybe, if you need help, I could... What? Well, where'd you get that phone? It's ancient. It doesn't even have texting? Wait a second. Please. You just build me one? Here, I upgraded for you. It can do texting items. It's such a... It's got a keychain. Texting items. It's got a keychain. I even signed you up for the Underground's number one social network. Now we're officially friends. <laughs> okay. I'm going to the bathroom. The. Whoa. Hey, look, I can walk without walking. Awkward. Okay, so. That's where we burst through the wall. I want a safe station. Please, dear lord, please give me a safe station. Please, I'm begging you. Nope! Yep, the big cans of nope. Now, there actually was a safe point if I go backwards. I'm just really hoping for a safe point somewhere around here. Oh, more places to read. Pink goop dry drips from this strange machine. Pink goop drips from this strange machine. Oh, I'm seeing so many strange things in here and I don't know how to express it. Looks like Officer's work table seems dusty. I'm gonna read the books. I'm gonna learn. All these books are labeled human history. Read one or do not. Um, read one. You looked inside a book. It's called, a, it's a comic book. A hideous android is running to school with toast in his mouth. Seems like it's late. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. All these books are labeled human history. Read one, sure. You look inside a book, it's a comic book. Two scantily clad uh, chefs are flinging energy pancakes at each other. 
doesn't seem strike you as very accurate. I wonder if they're all the same. VHS and DVDs are of various cartoons. They are all labeled Human History. All these books are labeled Human History. Read one, sure. You look inside a book. It's a comic of giant robot fighting a beautiful alien princess. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. Scientific books, they seem very dusty. <laughs> Woo! Um, that's kind of helpful, actually. The wardrobe is full of dirty lab coats and a single clean dress. I see! There are letters from many monsters here. Froggit, Snowy, Doggo. They're all unopened. Hmm, weird. It's a lamp with pink fish on the lampshade. There's no light bulb. Why is this game so strange? An incredible invention. When not in use, this bed folds into an extremely easy to draw box. <laughs> <laughs> it's a promo poster for uh, Metaton's TV premiere on the flap. It says, thank you for making my dreams come true. I'm incredibly creeped out about this guy. It's a bag of dog food. It's half full. No, it's actually half empty. It's half full. The fridge is filled with instant noodles and soda. Take a package of noodles. Oh, yes, please take it. Got the instant noodles. Can I take more? Filled with instant noodles and soda. Apparently not. I'm only taking one. Beat up figurine of a female human with cat ears. It's a teacup shaped like a yellow lizard. It's full of soda. It's a computer. It's accessing some kind of puzzle in Snowden. Seems like the notes to something, but it's all written in chicken scratch. Seems like a walkthrough to a game or... What? Wait, is it this game's walkthrough? Garbage can, but it's pretty cute. Is this doc, there might be a thing ahead of a save point instead of me backtracking to the other one, but the other one's right there. It literally is right there, I just wanna heal up. But is this character actually creating the game? Like that's so bizarre. Seeing just a strange laboratory in a place like this, you're filled with determination. Very, very strange. But, I guess we have no choice right now, but other than going through. Has that been on me the entire game? That's just weird. What about that room? Is that a room? Apparently not. The space behind the wall is only a few feet wide. Oh, it was just waiting there. I thought that was a door. So no, we're going this way. Alphys updated status. I just realized I didn't watch Undyne fight the human. Wait a minute. Dimensional box A and dimensional box B? I have still have Toriel and Papyrus' phone numbers. Let me call Toriel. Nobody picked up. Sell Papyrus' phone. Hotland, huh? I know it like the back of my hand. Which, since I'm always wearing gloves, I don't know anything about. Okay. Dimensional box A? Oh, I can store crap. Oh, it's so nice. Dimensional box? So I guess I keep boxes with me. Interesting. Interesting. Can I, can I seriously sell things? Because people were joking about that before, but there's items, as you can see, I clearly will never use. Well, I know she's unbeatable. I'll ask her about it later. Alpha's updated status. For now, I gotta call up the human and guide them. Do I need updates on this constantly? Whoa! Ah! Vulcan strolls in. I was wondering if there was a reason for me to stop walking like that. I'm going to mess with this one. Vulcan! I'm going to encourage you. Good job, Vulcan. Tell Vulcan it's doing a great job. It's attack being of extreme. Ah, just my best. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, ow, ow, no, 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 no. Don't be extreme. Parades around you proudly. Wait, 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 wait. Spare. You won, earned 40 gold, boom. Okay, so there's a way back down. If I had desperately needed to heal. I'm gonna call them in a minute. Can I just call you? Oh, I got a pick, don't I? No, I don't. I can move. I can move on this. 
This is just weird. This is weird. This is weird. Why would you make it like that? Oh, aren't we getting closer to the exit? Hey, hey, bingo. The whooshing sound of steam and cogs. It fills you with determination. The laboratory entrance of the magma chamber. Alpha's updated status. I hate using the phone. I don't want to use this. Left my, uh, A off. I see. Then... I... Ah! It, it, it's one of those things that'll teleport you. Sunderplane gets in the way? Not on purpose or anything. Sunderplane, um... Approach? You get close to Sunderplane. But not too close. Eh? A human? Whoa! Watching out there for that exhaust and everything. Shoot, whoa. Uh, Sunderplane looks over, then turns up its nose. Flirt? You tell Thunderplane it has a powerful rudder. Huh? You, you sicko? Oh god, that didn't help. <laughs> yeah, you have a nice rudder there. Sunderplane looks over, turns up its nose. Sunderplane approach. You get close to Sunderplane, but not too close. Eh, human? Okay, that didn't do it. It gave me this attack again, which is actually pretty easy to dodge, so I'm gonna mess with this thing until we can get to its uh, point. Spare. Don't get in my way. Oh, it's bombing me now. Whoa! Ow! Holy cannolis! Accidentally bumps you with its wing. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do here. Um, We're right by a safe station. I idiot! So I'm actually gonna spare my well, way through this. Sunderplane shakes its nose divisively at you. Sunderplane approach! Get close to center plane, but not too close. Yeah, human. Oh. Oh, you get close, but not too close. That wasn't good enough. Approach. Get close to center plane, but not too close. Eh, yeah, human. Okay. There we go. Center plane gives you a, a condescending barrel roll. <laughs> Spare. Woo, earned 60 gold. Yummy, I'm healing and kicking that now. Bam! The whooshing sound of steam and cogs it fills you with determination. Save. Nice! That wasn't that bad. Now that I kind of get them, you gotta mess with each monster in order to, uh, Alphys update status. Oh my god, I had my claw over the last digit for five minutes. Oh my god, I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna call. Chiesel, finally. Click? Whoever was calling hung up before I answered it. <laughs> Let's check up here. I was kind of hoping this was a dead end. Ring. Uh, hi. So, the blue lasers. Uh, I mean, Alpha's here. Hi. The blue lasers won't hurt you if you don't move. Orange ones, um, you have to be moving. And they, um, they won't, um, move through those ones. Uh, bye. Alpha's updated status. Oh my god, I did it! Claws haven't shook like that since Undyne called me to ask about the weather. Alright, so if I walk through these, nothing happens. Ah, I get it, I get it. Woo! Wait, there's no weather down here. Why did she call me? Okay, I got it. Oh. Oh dear! Darn it! Wait, I didn't move. It was orange. I didn't move. Oh! 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 Jeez! Okay, um... Ah! Oh, how do I do this? How do I do this? How do I get out of this situation? Oh! Eh! Okay, okay. I was stuck so bad. Alpha's updated status. Oh my god, I forgot to tell them where to go. I was posted a picture. Cute pic of me right now. It's a photo of a garbage can with several pink glittery filters over it. <laughs> Why did I- Oh. What happens if I choose down? 
Alvis here. The, the northern door will stay locked until you solve the puzzles on the right and the left. Uh, I think you should g go to the right first. Click. Okay. If you say so. Going down. Nothing happened. Okay. I was kind of hoping it would do something weird. Let's go to the right first. What's up, dude? The way to work is blocked, so I had time to catch Metaton's show on my phone. Special effects were amazing today. That human lo looked almost looked real. I almost died. Metaton? Yeah, he's the most popular star in the underground. His fan club probably has at least two, no, three dozen members. I hope his updated status. Wonder if it would be unfun if I explain the puzzle. Um, we'll see about that. The door leading through the area is closed, so I tried the puzzle. But I kept running out of ammo, and it kept restarting. And my two co-workers won't help. It's like they don't even want to go to work. Okay, I have ammo? Restart. Okay. Okay, let me try this again. Why don't you try? Try using the console. And that's all it says. Okay, it's gonna loop. So let me read the instructions. Shoot the opposing ship, move the boxes to complete your mission. Ah. I see, and I can't a- Oh. Duh. Oh, that's it? Congratulations. Wow, you solved it. I'm impressed. You must be a total nerd. Well, now you guys can go to work. Or at least there's another puzzle I gotta do. Bang! Oh, I was kind of hoping it would, like, double, double jump me over, but it didn't. Okay. Boing! Let's do the next one. Ring! Alpha's here! Th that blue laser seems to be totally impassable. B -b 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 As the royal scientist, I have some tricks up my sleeve. I'll hack into the hot land laser database and take it out. Click. Oh, they actually did. I was expecting it to come right back on. Finally, someone turn off that laser. Now that we're free, we can... Well, uh, I guess we'll just keep standing here. We were hanging out when suddenly a bunch of puzzles reactivated out of nowhere. This is a huge problem. It rules! They've got to cancel school over us. Alright, well, okay, so same puzzle, I assume. Shoot the opposing ship, move the boxes to complete your mission. Okay, so... How do I actually know which... Oh, I see. Ah, okay, I get it. I get it. Okay, so I need to move that over, get the maximum amount of boxes out of my way because I only have two bullets. Down and over. Over. And now I have two bullets. Boom. Boom. Congratulations. Puzzle Mastermind. This is fun. Boing. I gotta go up, and that should be all we need. Nice. Shoulda healed, shoulda saved, but I didn't. Alpha's updated status. Whatever, I'll just explain it. Uh, I think, um, hey, how about the puzzles on the left and right? They are a bit difficult to explain, but, uh, you already solved them? I thought, I thought that she was, he, she was watching me. It, I don't know. Awesome! Yeah, dude, you're the best! Oh, boy. Okay. Oh, no. Not the game show. Ring. Hey, it's kind of dark in there, isn't it? Don't worry. I'll hack into the light system and brighten it up. It's the game show. Oh, no. I'm on a cooking show. Oh, yes! Welcome, beauties, to the Underground's premiere cooking show! Cooking with a killer robot. Oh, good. Preheat your ovens because we've got a special recipe for you today. We're going to be making a cake. My lovely assistant here will gather the ingredients. Everyone give them a big hand. Yay, I feel so special and glittery. We'll need sugar, milk, and eggs. Go for it, sweetheart. Well, let me get it. Here's the eggs. You found the eggs. 
Here's the milk and the sugar. And here you go. Great job, just put them in the middle of this counter. Here you go. Perfect, great job, beautiful. We've got all the ingredients we need to bake the cake. Milk, sugar, eggs. Oh my, what a magnificent moment. How can I forget? We're missing the most important ingredients. A human soul. Ah, uh, ah, uh ah, -uh, ah, uh -uh. I'm not running. Ring? Hello? I'm kind of in the middle of something here. Oh, wait a second. Couldn't you make a... Couldn't you use a... Couldn't you make a substitution in the recipe? A substitution? You mean a different non-human ingredient? Why? Uh, what if someone's... Vegan? Vegan? Uh, well, I mean, that's a brilliant idea, Alphys! Actually, I happen to be an option right here! I have an option right here. NCD brand, always convenient human soul flavored substitute. A can of which is just over on that counter. I could run out of here. Why am I playing along? Well, darling, why don't you go get it? Certainly, let me just go and do that. Yeah, be or be. Don't do it. No, no. By the way, our show runs on a strict schedule. If you can't get it in the next one minute, we'll just have to go back to the original plan. So better start climbing, beautiful. <laughs> oh no, there's not enough time to climb up. Fortunately, I might have a plan. When I was upgrading your phone, I added a few features. You see that huge button that says jetpack? My phone, watch this. My phone's just gonna launch up. Oh good, it's on me. I was gonna say, my phone's just, go, phone's gone. There. You should have just enough fuel to reach the top. Just enough? Now get up there. Oh dear. Excuse, oh, you're a jerk. Oh no. Stop trying to season me. I know I taste delicious, but don't, oh. Oh, how was I supposed to dodge that? Oh. What? You're horrible. Do you know how horrible you are? Ow. Ow. Yeah, the sprinkles. These I can dodge. These are smaller. Thank you. Jeez Louise. Okay, let's move. No, it's... Oh, oh, I didn't know I could cross this. That was my problem. Okay. You just gotta dodge everything. Oh. Oh. This is insane. Oh. Ow. Okay. Oh, way over there. Ow. Keep going. Just dodge everything. Oh. Stop pouring everything on me. Okay, I can- oh! Ow! I got it! My, my. It seems you've bested me. But only because you had the help of the brilliant Dr. Alphys! Oh, I loathe to think of what would happen to you without her. It is a her! Well, toodles. Gulp. Oh yes, a mountain substitution. Haven't you ever seen a cooking show before? I already baked the cake ahead of time, so forget it. Oh. Ring. Wow. We we did it. We we really did it. Great job out there, team. W well, uh. Anyway, let's keep heading forward. By forward, you mean um. <gasps> Ooh. Ominous structure looms in the distance. You're filled with determination. Woo. But now that I say that it's safe, it's glued to the table. <laughs> You're awful. Oh, it's 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 just over? I was wondering, like, what are they gonna do? It's a microwave. That's great if you're a microwave fan. It's an oven. It looks pretty modern. Is there anything in the fridge I can take? It's a fridge. It's strangely warm. Okay, then. So, that actually was that, and you're supposed to keep progressing. Okay, I was wondering. Kinda curious. Yes! See that building in the distance? That's the core, the source of all power for the underground. It converts geothermal energy into magical electricity by, uh, anyway. That's where we're, wh that's why we're going, uh, that's where we're going to go. In the core is an elevator directly to Asgore's castle. And from there, you can go home. 
I want go home. Go home is good. I like go home. Because I'm pretty sure that's the point of the game. But either way, that was a big episode. And that was actually really awesome with a crazy scene with the robot. I'm not sure how much longer this game really is. I really don't know how big the game is at all. Because obviously, like I said, I've looked nothing up about this thing. But either way, I'm having a ton of fun with it. So it doesn't bother me at all. I definitely want to play it again. And actually see the other endings and the alternate versions of stuff. But that's, that's all for another time. But either way, for now... Thank you all so much for watching. Remember to like the videos and subscribe for more. And I will see you all in the next episode of Undertale. See you.